All right, let's uh, get started. Tonight we are playing Mark Lung's Revenge of the Bitch. It's the game that uh, we were voting on last week. Uh, had a good showing, but not quite enough to beat out uh, L.A. Noir. What do you mean the bench has scrolling by? So this game is controlled, from what I could tell, entirely by keyboard. That's going to be unusual. Alright, um, so I am going to start a new game. And here we go. Nice, uh, nice lengthy loading screen. There we go. Four years ago, an evil curse swept across untitled. Those who didn't eat their vegetables transformed into cockroaches. Almost concurrently, a new religion was founded, the Church of Vegetology. It's taught people to eat vegetables. Taking advantage of people's fear, vegetology spread like rabbits on Viagra, threatening to surpass the influence of the dominant religion, the Church of Nubism. You are Mark Lung, an atheist, a selfish communist, and a simple ginseng farmer from the Kingdom of Hong Kong. Brace yourself. For the fate of Untitled shall soon lie in your hands. Okay. Oh, you know what? Shoot. I'm a noob. Speaking of Church of noob Noobism, I'm going to have to, because uh, I had to disable the, the sound for, uh, because this game is kind of weird on all that stuff, so let me... Uh, Let me uh, just get this now, then I have to restart that video. Well, hopefully, yeah. Uh, at least give uh, those people a chance who got it, who work, needed to get it working anyway. That's a little better. Okay. Now we go through this stupid loading screen again. Uh, it went faster that time. Four years ago. I didn't even have to read it. They could have read it for me. Across untitled. Those who didn't eat their vegetables transformed into cockroaches. Almost concurrently, a new religion was founded. The Church of Vegetology. It taught people to eat vegetables. 
taking advantage of people's fear. Vegetology spread like rabbits on Viagra, threatening to surpass the influence of the dominant religion, the Church of Nubism. You are Mark Lowe, an atheist, a selfish communist, and a simple ginseng farmer from the Kingdom of Hong Kong. Brace yourself for the fate of Untitled shall soon lie in your hands. Oh, well that wasn't much of a video, huh? Opening a chest. From what I understand, there are uh, that there's a lot of uh, FMVs in this game telling the story. Freaking healing sand again. I just need one more piece of ginseng and I'm done for the day. All right. So I changed it to arrows. I think. Yeah, as I was saying before, this is. Completely keyboard driven, so it's gonna be different. Haven't had a key completely keyboard driven game in quite a while. What's up, Panda? Can I visit the Panda? A chair is blocking your way. Oh, no kidding. <laughs> is that is that is that the big obstacle? A chair? Sir, can I stab the chair? <gasps> Apparently not. Okay. Chairs are uh, insurmountable obstacles. Should leave here until I have my last piece of ginseng. Apparently, I missed something. Oh, snap! A monster! Strike a monster before it reaches you to gain turn priority in battle. Press tab to target a monster, and then press 1 to attack with your current weapon. This is not a kitten, sure. This is a monster. It's important to know the difference. It could save your life one day. See how it roars. You're no match for me. All right. First monster. <laughs> Second monster. Oh, yeah. oh, I missed the monster. Crap. Yeah. Alright. Take that monster. You wreck the discipline. That was clearly a ferocious monster. And it was out to murder me. Skill points are up. Are owned by owning monster units. Collect skill points to unlock more badass abilities. To check out how many skill points are required to unlock new abilities, go to classes and abilities, uh, and then all abilities. Each action ability has three ranks associated with it. By accumulating enough use counts in battle, the abilities rank will increase and become more effective. 
to use action abilities in field mode, go to menu, class and abilities, and action abilities. Okay. Say so yeah, another monster. Even King, even uh, Kindy would agree. Look at that thing. Not good. Mm. Ah, that monster. Mm. All right, I'm gonna attack the flying monster first. Get that out of the way. Down to one monster left. I'm, I'm barely escaping with my life here. Yeah. Thanks for the experience. I mastered the skill of attacking. All right. Like all abilities, passive ability must be learned while the class it belongs to is active. But unlike action abilities, the passive once passive is learned, it may be activated at any time. Da, 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 da. Okay. Ah oh, man, there's another monster on the other side of that bridge. Meow. What? How did that oh, monster turn shit. into two monsters? So basic JRPG combat, not the most exciting kind of combat to watch, I'm sure. But hopefully I get some Thanks new skills for the experience. in. Thanks for the experience. Alright, let's see what's in this chest. A torn cardboard arm. Just obtained a to card torn cardboard armor. Seeing that you're pretty naked in terms of gear, it's probably a good idea to press F1, open up the main menu, and uh, upgrade yourself some sexy cardboard armor. Oops. Equip. Any accessories? Nope. Oh god, it's another kind of monster. This does not look good. Oh, jeez, look at that thing, it's ferocious. That's a, it's gonna help society just to get this thing off the streets. There could be children in this forest. The world is now a safer place. Phase rolled to oblivion. <laughs> okay, the phase hiking is pr pretty bad. Special abilities to the character is a unique special ability that can be used in the field. Da 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 da. Mark may use an action ability, combo strikes in the field. The special attack is bound to key to and is only available to build, only available to Mark as long as he has a sword equipped. Da, da, da. It's a defensive ability. He moves into a defensive stance and automatically strikes at an enemy when it comes close. Okay. I think I got it. Oh. 
turned around. Rabbits around here? They're huge! I almost tripped on one of them. <laughs> Fascinating. Oh. Collecting ginseng again? Come on, baby cakes, take a break. Dude, I'm serious. Can't you leave me alone? Did you just call me a dude? Couldn't. Let's take a break and spend some time together. Come on, man, I'm busy. You call me a dude and now you're calling me a man? Couldn't. Oh, oh. Wanna make out? No. But you're my boyfriend! Mark! Okay. <laughs> so, uh. That, I don't even have anything to add to that. That's pretty terrible. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, snap! Oh, these monsters. These monsters have me down to half, half health. I should do my... Kind of healing, healing sand. Yeah, take that, monsters. Huh. I'm all healed up. Mm. Man, how many attacks does this monster get? Yeah. I'm good. Level up. Cool. Oh, jeez. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to stay far away from her. Speaking of monsters. Bunnies are tough. Yeah. I mean monsters. Those monsters are tough. Damn, I'm good. I feel, yeah, I forgot about that. Nope. Thanks for the reminder. You see how many JRPGs I play? I don't remember things about initiative. So there's a bear guarding a chest there. No match for me. <laughs> the heck? What kind of a bear is that? Okay, and she turns into a little bulldog 
and attacks him. <laughs> Giant bear escapes. <clears throat> and so she attacks me. You turned into a dog and beat me again, Frida! It was a love bite! A love bite? That was more like a bitch bite! Why would she attack me while in the battle? Hey! You slashed my face with your sword! It was a counterattack, okay? I can't help it! Don't even try shifting the blame on me! <laughs> That's it! I'm done! Oh, really? You're done? Can we make out now? No! I'm done, as in I'm through with you! I'm leaving you! Goodbye! And don't follow me! What's your problem, man? My problem? Alright, how about this? You're the most- Go on, you can say anything! I will if you let me finish- I can take whatever crap you throw at me! Will you just shut up? I know! It's my eyebrow, isn't it? No, it's- My armpits, right? No, it's- It's these! My <laughs> juggernauts! Because when they swing, I notice they- No, no! You're annoying, get it? You're annoying! You're too clingy, you talk too much, you can't cook, you make me pay for dinner, you have permanent PMS, you have no friends and no job, so you stalk me 24-7, and worst of all, you're nuts! You have an imaginary polar bear named Yehudit! What the hell, man, Yehudit? Do you know how many parties I don't get invented because of you? My social life sucks! Oh, and hey, guess what? You have a mustache! <laughs> What's the matter with you? It looks f***ing disgusting, Frida! Those are Chewbacca beams on your face! <laughs> Okay, okay, maybe I went a little overboard there. Frida, calm down, okay? Wait, why am I even apologizing when you're the one at fault? You need to control your temper, cause you're always- Okay. I, I, yeah. I, you break up with Frida, or did you? Well, I'm on the, am I on the, yeah, I am. This is the other side of that chair that I saw before. Hello, sofa. This mysterious artifact recovers your HP and offers you the chance to save your game. Should you fail on the journey ahead, you will return to where you last saved with all the skill points carried over. Alright. <laughs> ah, man. It's a monster. Not good. I was ambushed. Throwing bamboo at me, jerk. Putting the laughter in manslaughter. See those Snap. monsters with that flying monster? <coughs> Man, how many turns did these monsters get?
All right, escape the monsters. Putting the laughter in manslaughter. You, sir, you're half dead, and it's probably a good idea to ingest some healing sand. I think I already used my healing sand. Yeah, I don't have any to use. Apparently it uh, underestimated how quickly I would die, or get low on health. This does not look good. What's with these monsters teaming up like this? Happy death day to you. Quickly, hide behind the treasure chest. Pirates? Nothing to see here. Move along. What? Why did you do that? Bag size increased by one. Okay. Cardboard sword. It appears that your tree bunch is proving to be a disappointing piece of shit. Maybe wise to switch to this new sword and see if it is more effective in slaughtering these monsters. I will do just that. Ah, uh, press press one. And my health is getting really low. I need some more of that sand. Phase rolled to oblivion. Is there any kind of uh, way to? Myself didn't look like it. Maybe, maybe in this chest.
Can't you tell us what you're trying to hide? What the hell is your problem, man? Grog. There you are, my ladies. It's a lot, prick. Hope you're happy, you stupid flower picker. Would it be alright if I asked you to please stop running away? Rog, we're pirates, you know. We're not trained to chase after runaway queens and princesses. Mm, Rog, but we uh, didn't run away. We were kidnapped. A bastard back there kidnapped us. Rog? Revenge of the bitch. So I have to, when I get through the tutorial zone. Pick up your last piece of ginseng. At least I got the ginseng. Time to go home. Alright, we can save on the sofa. If it'll let us. There we go. Well, it did say the kingdom of Hong Kong. No, Panda. I was trying to avoid a fight. Ah, a new kind of monster. I didn't know if it was the healing that saved, or the saving that healed me, or starting in the new zone. Damn, I'm good. But I'll, I'll go find out. You know what these red coaches, couches remind me of? They remind me of uh, Nickelodeon in the 90s. Uh, Counterattacking is my passive, so I should I should be good to go on that. Panda hater. Yeah, she looks like a panda hater, all right. Side quests are side or side tests and yield journey points and various rewards when completed. To accept a side quest, talk to a character with a thing above their head. To view side quest, go to menu quest and press Q or press Q in the field mode. Da 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 da. Panda Hater, greetings, traveler. I'm a member of the Society of Panda Haters. Do you have time to hear my plead? There's panda overpopulation in Hong Kong. Before long, this country will be overflowing with these violent, unintelligent, and ugly creatures. Will you lend a hand in keeping the panda population under control? What's in it for me? 
Return after you slay ten pandas, and I will give you this sexy tree bark jacket. Oh, do I, is it something I need to activate? Let's take a look. Abilities. Oh, you guys are right. Thank you. Now I'll be much better at fighting off those evil monsters. Are they gerbils or hamsters? Oh, it's a hamster. Not good. You don't understand. These are monsters. Look at this thing. That thing's up to my knee. Yeah. And clearly it attacked yeah. me. I was just minding myself, trying to get quested. Murder pandas. Oh, check out that monster. Giant rabbit. Mm -hmm. What? Ah, oh, sh. He gets two mm. attacks for every one of mine. Look at that, I'm already at 20 health. Mm. Fail. <laughs> this game is really hostile to cats. Try this again. This time we're, we're not picking a fight with that particular monster. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. That, that monster is uh, a little scarier than the others. I'm I suck at uh, getting initiative. Take that monster. Putting the laughter in manslaughter. Not funny. <laughs> You're right, but that's still Australia. <laughs> it's the kingdom of Hong Kong. Oh, sh Miss. You wreck the discipline.
not exactly sure where I'm supposed to be going, other than to have a quest to kill pandas along the way. Maybe that's all I need to be doing. Oh, a treasure chest. Bees. Oh, snap! Ah, oh, it's done to me. Ow. Jerk. Uh. Wow. Yeah. Take that bee. Happy death day to you. If that bee had teamed up with that monster over there, that that could have been a little more painful. But I'm not going to get here to give him any ideas. This monster looks a lot like the other kinds of monster, but it's a uh, it's not an orange. Oh, get away from me, monster! Uh, look at that monster! It's like hunting me down. This thing is. Truly terrifying. <laughs> no, I, I was trying to avoid. I'm trying to avoid the monster. No, pounced. Oh snap! Oh man, it brought friends. This is what happens when you try to avoid fights with the monsters. Thanks for the experience. Ambushed. Ah, oh, sh. Does it count as an ambush when I walk up to it? Apparently so. Phase road to oblivion. Alright, there's one of those pandas. Oh, here's one right here, too. See if I can't sneak up behind this one. Oh, snap! I was ambushed again. It's crazy. Oh, like, yeah, I didn't think about that. Yeah. yeah. Look at that. Strength and honor, motherfucker. Yep. Yeah, I embedded this. It's these monsters. They just got they've got me off my game. I 
I've obtained three jellyfish penises. I didn't know I needed those. I could have left those in the box, frankly. Take that monster. See how your monster friend is oh, yeah. gonna like it. Ow. How many uh in pieces? <laughs> just cheesy punchlines are just not so good. Two out of ten panda slain. That monster over there. Alright, I'm gonna go save at the couch. Good, another monster. Still trying to actually get initiative. I'm so bad at that. I <laughs> ambushed. Not good. Lazy panic. Okay, we have a treasure chest guarded by a vicious looking monster. See, so he couldn't just let me get the treasure in peace, he just had to pounce. Critters. Oh. Instant rabies. Ah. Yeah, but spell is that? Yeah. Oh. Did the instant rabies wear off? I don't see the debuff anymore.
and kick so much ass! Level up. Ambushed. Ugmark, help! Epic win. All right, almost to the save point. And then hopefully the bear of the cave. It's Dick with a capital D. Thou hast been officially pawned. Another ah. bear. It's Dick with a capital D. Thou hast been officially pawned. Man, this cave has got a lot of crap in it. Ugmark, help! And, oh, just two bears. Hopefully they don't gang up on Dick and murder him. And when is uh taking a good turn? Oh, here we go. You. Yeah. <laughs> and he counterattacks the other guy.
No offense, but you're utterly fucking pathetic. <laughs> okay, there's the feigned death. I don't even got a chance to use it. How do I get up? Okay, swap. Save. Instant rabies. for the stands. Attack! Time's a wasting. Let me look at uh Okay. Wonder if I turn one off if the other it turns the other one off. Well, it seems like they're both on. I guess. More jellyfish penises. It looked like the little yellow thing at the bottom was, was lit for both of them. No, I enter, I'm pressing enter. It's not changing anything. E doesn't do anything either. Or P. See, on this one, like, notice I haven't it turned it on on this guy, this passive. And I turn it on, and then, it, then it's lit on him. 
on these if I toggle between it's lit on both of them yeah I can deactivate it it's weird it didn't now it's deactivated on both of them oh wait I don't see the move the E here okay well I still want it on that one that's weird okay moving on are we almost to that stupid bear what the heck Dude, isn't this a feng shui shrine? A what? What's this pile of furniture doing here? It's a feng shui shrine. It requires the most talented feng shui masters to construct this. But how? Furniture can't be moved with bare hands. That's why, why they're called feng shui masters. And what? It's supposed to do something? Of course. Feng shui is all about the arrangement of furniture to generate positive and negative energy. Uh, for instance, if you put a chair in front of a table, a person would be drawn to sit down and do some accounting. That's positive feng shui energy. But if you rearrange the chair so that it's standing upside down, the same person would get seriously injured. That's negative feng shui energy. See, Mark, two pieces of furniture can change a person's life. Now, imagine what this could do. So this is generating positive or negative. Negative, oh, a lot negative. It's probably set up to punish some dudes like big time. You feel the love? <laughs> of course you don't. No, sir. What energy? <laughs> Dude, you're totally high. Real negative energy. It's like evil shit, man. Can you feel it? I think I'm feeling it. You've been smoking grandma's opium, haven't you? What? No, I haven't. Giant bear. Okay, who wants some? Ah! Mm -hmm. Oh, shoot, this is my heal mark. I wanted to heal dick. Attacks 30% attack damage and inflicts stun if it interrupts a pending action. Gains hate up status. I don't know what that is. I'll try it. Your mama's so stupid, she puts lipstick on her head to make up her mind. Okay. Thirty percent attacks. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. I'm about out of AP on Mark. Miss. I'm not supposed to miss. Delivers lesser healing to target and tiny healing to others. Stupid giant bear. What items do I have? Cover. Oh, I'm 
I get low, I don't see the crap about those items. Fighting. Yeah. I said some. Wait, did one of those items increase action points? I'll have to look at that again. Yeah, I thought I might be able to prevent his something or other, but it was kind of dumb. Yeah, okay, so I can recover action points with that. I mean, I have a lot of that, so I'm gonna go ahead and use it. There you go, Mark. Have some action points. Mm. Oh yeah, I never noticed the arrow before. The little teal one is that I assume that's what you mean. Um Okay, we need to do some healing. On dick. <sighs> Bear joins the battle. You're not supposed to join the battle. Take that stupid man bear guy. Damn, I'm good. Level up. Dick, what's this? That's it. It's a furniture glove. The tool to move furniture around. Only new priests and feng shui masters have them. Sweet. Wait, what are you doing? Take that off. Dude, I feel like I can move chairs. Let's try it out. Wow, I was joking earlier in the game when, when I was flippantly saying, you're a male nerd, about the moving the chair that was blocking the path. I didn't know that would be like a central point of the game. cave. Seems like something I can do. Take 
that chair. No, kitty. Help me! Ah, missing Mark. Take that, cats and rats. Time's a wasting. Hate up to hate up status with direct all incoming single. Yeah, we already figured that out. It's Dick with a capital D! <gasps> Next! Some. Oh, no mice for, to distract them. Miss, miss, miss. Stun immunity. I like that. I assume that's probably a passive. But good to know. What? Still wearing these vegetology faith belts. So let's go home. <laughs> what? You don't like the belts? I told you I hate vegetology. Dick, it doesn't matter. I want the other one, the new one. Fine, which way to the church? For years, we've been ridiculed by these so-called vegetologists. 
threatening us the impending doom of turning into cockroaches if we don't eat our vegetables. But my friends, today that claim has been falsified. Today, thanks to the guidance of the Lord and the blessing of the new, our friends and families have returned. Today, we witness the beginning of the end of vegetology. We've carried ourselves through these dark times, and our way of life has been met with ignorant cynicism and doubt and fear, with ill-informed fools telling us that we can't. But we pressed on with that nubis creed that sums up the spirit of our people. Yes, we can. This creed was written into the founding documents of our religion. Yes, we can! Yes, we can! Throughout these several years of oppression and discrimination, we have fought forward with that timeless belief, Yes, we can! Yes, we can! And thus, we shall once more reign as the number one religion Yes, we can! Yes, we can! When vegetologists say, No, circus, you can't! What do you say? <laughs> yes, we can! Yes, we can, mother Yes, we can! 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 Okay, so yeah, that is. <laughs> that is Revenge of the Bitch. I assume at some point the bitch will get revenge, but I guess that'll be, uh, an exercise left up to the viewer because we are calling it a night. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'll see you later.